Hi and welcome to my channel once again. This is Daniel for D Vibes Entertainment. It's another time and another day. I have another video for you, and this video actually comes from one of my followers who wanted to know how she can actually deal with the default steal, default roll, and default crawl. And my video is going to be based on these three titles, how we can deal with them. And without wasting time, before that, if you're watching my video for the very first time, all you have to do is just click on the subscription button and also don't forget to click on the bell so that you don't miss out on any video that I'll be uploading. Okay, we go straight into our software. Remember, this particular video can apply to any other uh, version of Premiere Pro. So, we're going to first start with the default steal. Now, this is our software right here. Okay, you go up on title and you click it and just below here you'll see new title. And below title, you just scroll and go to the default steal. And it is the default steal that we are starting with. So, you click and immediately you'll get this box here. You'll just say okay and you're directed to this box well if you're familiar with this box of course you already know that we have the toolbox right here and we have our effects here and right in here is where we shall be writing our titles and of course you get into your box here sometimes you're going to have it in a gray version or you might have it black with a black background well mine has given me a gray background but it doesn't matter so you click in there and if you see it blinking well it's asking you to start typing in and of course we shall type in our title i'll just choose any title at random well if you know titles if you've watched movies you know those titles that come at the beginning of the movie okay basically that is what the default still usually applies for so i'll just uh, type in something like D vibes entertainment entertainment i hope i've got it right now okay so this is D vibes entertainment i can just click here and just click in here so just below here of course you have your different type of fonts and i'll just go at random and just select any font here as you can notice it has gone beyond my frame so i'll just decrease on the front size a bit so that i have the right font that actually is actually fitting in here if you find that it is not aligned well you can just go right here just below your toolbox and just below here we have the center and you can just align it into the best position that you want okay so this is the first title as you can see as you know you can always give it color if you want so you just go down here in your effects and you'll find color i'll just go for a brighter color i'll go for a yellow okay something like that okay so this is our default steel as you know default steel is just going to give you a title that is actually static unless you put some effects in it so this is our first title right here which is called the default steel so i'll just drag it into our timeline and there you are so this is our full default steel it is static as you can see as you can if you don't it's, it's actually called steel okay so it's just steel; it doesn't move so that is how you can actually achieve the default steel our next font we are going to be dealing with is the default roll now if you've watched if you've watched movies usually at the end of the movie there are the cast that moves from the bottom going upwards so those are the rolls so i'll just scroll this to a new fresh screen and i'll go to my title right here go to new title and i'll just click the default roll and here i'll just say okay now because we need names or oh, it's usually a cast that runs from bottom 
to top I'll just use a couple of names as my roles so I'll just click my tools I'll just go to T for typing and then I come into my window here and I'll just start typing in a few names I'll go for random names like John then I'll say enter and I'll put in Mary now I might put in Millie then I can go for John's oh capital letters come in there I'll just go for John's I can say Peter then I can put in um, let's say Mike then I can uh, say maybe uh, can go for maybe Daniel and I can put in Ronald just go back to my selection tool and just try and pull this as you can see these are my names so what I can do is still you can go just down here and select a font that you feel you want to use okay for your role okay if you find they are big then you can go to your font size right here in the effects and you can just limit them squeeze them down there then i can maybe also use uh, the leading just to space them a little bit just like that again i'll just come and drag them right here in the middle or i can just go to my line in the center and i click on the horizontal center just there so that they are in the middle so so if you want them keep them moving just come here on the roll crawl option and then you make sure that they are clicked on the roll and you can also click on these two boxes here start off screen and end off screen and you can say okay so this is our role here i've not given them a color but you can always choose if you want to give them a color you can go down here and give them a color so i'll go with white since i have a background that is black so i'll just click there when i'm done and i'll just drag my role right here okay now when i come here i can always play them and see how they are moving now you realize they are moving so fast okay i'll just stretch this a little i can play this back again now you realize that they are moving so fast now if you realize that they are moving so fast what you can do is just stretch them a bit okay and then try and play again now depending on how fast you want them to go you can always just keep stretching if you want them faster you can stretch in once so that is our role okay and our last kind of for, for title that we're going to be dealing with remember we've already dealt with the default steel default role as you can see and now next i'll take you through on how you can deal with the crawl now the crawl if you are a fan of watching news you should have you should be seeing the kind of titles or the kind of words that just scroll just below the screen with the news anchor there now those are the crawls now how do we deal with them Again, you'll go to title, you click your title, you go to new title, and right here you slope down to default crawl. Click default crawl and you say okay. Okay, now again you might do the same thing. This round time round I have a black background, and then you do the same thing. You go to your toolbox, you click title, and because we need a sentence or we need words that are going to be crawling just below our screen I'll just come here and come up with maybe a sentence I could say we are we are learning the crawl steps Premier Pro today. Today with Daniel. Okay, so that is our crawl. Now 
also this depends on where you want to put your crawl usually the crawl runs below just down on the screen but it all depends on where you want to put it some people might decide to put it in the middle if you want to put it at the bottom like i usually see you can also put it at the bottom now uh, again if you feel it is the fonts are too big you can always come to the font size and reduce them a bit you can just scroll a bit so that they reduce or if you feel you need to change a font you can always just go down here there's the number of fonts that you can actually use as you can see a couple of them there okay so I'll just maintain the font that I have so this is our crawl right here now we need to put some effects again you'll just go right here just below title or just next to T okay and then you'll just click when you click it it will give you this now of course you have to make sure that the dot is it is clicked under crawl left usually depending on which country you're coming from some countries the crawls run from the right going to they run from the left going to the right while others run from the left from the right going to the left so it depends from which country you're coming from but this time around our crawl is running to the left so that's why it's clicked onto the left so you make sure it is clicked there and then you also click on the start of screen and end of screen and you say okay when we are done we'll just close this and bring our crawl right here on our timeline again you try and play it and see how it's running now you realize it's running so fast now if you realize it's running so fast all you have to do is stretch it and then play it again and see how fast it's running if you feel it's still running fast you can still stretch it a little more and then play it okay so those are our three titles as of today i hope this video is going to be useful to you if you're dealing with titles if you have any question or comment please you can get down below in my comment section and give me a comment or if you have any other video you'd like me to do for you that's it for today please don't forget to subscribe onto my channel and don't forget to click on the bell so that you don't miss any other video that I'll be uploading. That is it from me to you. Let's meet in another video. Bye-bye.